he built Amazon, he built AWS. Now, he wants to build the intelligence layer for global industry. Jeff Bezos has been saying it for well over a year. First on the deal book stage in 2024, then again at Italian Tech Week 2025. AI is real and it's, it's going to change every industry like electricity, end quote. And recently, he had it something more controversial. Yes, AI is a bubble, but it's a good bubble, end quote. Because even when good bubbles burst, the infrastructure they leave behind changes the world. Today, Bezos is creating a new bubble that could redefine the future of AI plus industry with Project Prometheus, a $6.2 billion industrial AI startup that might become the most consequential company he has founded since Amazon. So, the question really is, what is Prometheus? For those who are not well versed in Greek mythology, Prometheus is the titan who stole fire and knowledge from the gods and gave it to humans, symbolizing progress and rebellion against divine limits. And Amazon's Jeff Bezos has very clearly borrowed that name and symbolism, signaling its ambition to ignite next era of intelligence. Quite original, to say the least. Well, in other words, Jeff Bezos' new startup, Prometheus, will be using AI to understand and manipulate the physical world, including machines, factories, engines, materials, supply chains, and robotics. And Bezos has assembled the closest thing to an AI Avengers team in AI engineering. Researchers from OpenAI, DeepMind, Meta, Google X, nearly 100 scientists and engineers on day one, led by Vic Bajaj, ex Google X scientist, physicist, and biotech innovator, backed by venture veterans and Amazon era operators, funded with $6.2 billion out of the gate. Prometheus is not an AI lab, it's actually an AI powered industrial research and development engine. And the goal is simple, but well, quite insane. Build models that can design things, fix things, assemble things, upgrade things across every industry from aerospace to energy to manufacturing. If OpenAI builds intelligence for knowledge, Prometheus wants to build intelligence for everything else. Bezos believes in two things. Number one, AI is the new electricity. Every industry that touched electricity changed forever. Factories, transport, homes, economies. AI will be bigger. And number two, AI is a good bubble. His logic? It's this. The dot-com bubble created Amazon, Google, broadband, cloud and half the internet economy. After it burst, the AI bubble will do the same for robotics, chips, industrial automation and science. Clearly, Bezos is building it for the decade after the bubble pops. That's the real bet. Most AI labs today focus on content conver conversation, search reasoning coding. Prometheus is going after applied physics plus engineering plus real world systems. The true trillion dollar frontier. And here's what that includes. AI that can design hardware. AI that can model complex materials, AI that can simulate factories, AI that can optimize supply chains, and of course, AI that can discover scientific breakthroughs, AI that works with robotics and edge devices, AI that reduces industrial waste and cost. This is the unsexy part of AI, the part that runs the world. And Bezos wants to own that stack. So let's look at the pattern. Amazon in 1997 built the internet's retail backbone. AWS in 2006 built the world's cloud backbone. Prometheus in 2025, a shot at building 
the world's industrial AI backbone. So, every decade, as we have seen, Bezos finds the next foundational layer. Prometheus fits perfectly into that arc. If it works, industries won't just use AI. They will run on Prometheus. And Prometheus directly challenges this. OpenAI and Google on scientific models challenges. NVIDIA on simulation plus robotics tool chains. Siemens, GE, Bosch on industrial automation. Tesla on physical world AI. National Labs on science supercomputing. Also challenges manufacturing giants worldwide. Bezos is building an AI company that sits at the intersection of industry, science, robotics, cloud, and pretty much no one else is attacking that full stack. Not even close. So finally, Jeff Bezos called AI a good bubble once. And now, even if this bubble bursts, the infrastructure it leaves behind will define the next century. Clearly, Prometheus is Bezos' bet on the next trillion dollar companies will be industrial AI systems. And the world's next big productivity boom will come from AI that understands how the physical world works. Even Reliance's startup accelerator Geogen Next, its head, Ame Mashelkar, recently on front page, said the same. When we asked, when will India have the NVIDIA moment? Please make sure to check it out if you haven't already. So, looks like Reliance is also betting big on industrial plus AI. Now, coming back to Bezos. He built Amazon. He built AWS. Now, he wants to build the intelligence layer for global industry. The only question is, will Project Prometheus become the industrial brain of the world or will it reveal just how hard it is to teach AI the laws of physics? Please do let us know what you think in the comments below and stay with us as we track the most ambitious AI company launched this decade.